everybody welcome, welcome back to another video on my channel if you're new hi welcome to bear beauty thank you guys so very much for tuning in hope you guys are enjoying this video and if you are go ahead and give me a subscribe and also like this video if you do enjoy it or you find it very informative or very interesting whichever either of the two you like go ahead and give me that like and also follow me on instagram at bear beauty services i tend to do polls over there to get a nail idea going or whichever and also to discuss so yes so follow me on bear beauty services i'll link it in the screen and also in the description below so for today's video i'll be doing some ombre nails as per usual because they're my favorite thing to do so i'll be doing it on sculptures forms if you guys are new here um these eyes i'm playing around in colors especially like the botch colors that i've made in, in in recent times recent not so recent but yes i've made them like probably a year ago and i have them sitting there for a long time and i decided uh, instead of me throwing them out it makes sense that i do you know use them to create videos on youtube or for you guys to watch so i will be doing sculpting my nails as per usual i think i like sculpting my nails because i get a cleaner finish in terms of the how straight the nail is i like it I really do like it so today I am using this baby blue this baby blue is very marbled I used it in a video with doing smurn snurf <laughs> smurf yes and yes smurf um, as I said I was complaining in the videos per use and I'm, yes, it's a botch color so I don't know why I was complaining so I'll be using it for today's video I'll be doing some cloud nails and I thought it was just appropriate and the marbling effect in it would give it that you know that look so, so I'm going in with the mar the, the blue the baby blue I'm taking it that dog guys I must say I'm really proud of myself I will try to link a video in the iCards just to show you guys where I'm coming from and what practice creates yeah, and what practice makes so I am going down I'll take up a nice nice bead and pull the product down put it on the stress, stress point area and pull the product down and then I'll take another bead um, to go to you know Get it to the length that I want it and you know the appropriate you know weight and size and width and whatever. So I know I'm contouring the nail, ensuring that it's properly flushed, blend into the you know the first bead of acrylic that I need. You guys have to know that not everybody's method is going to suit you. That's why I wanted to touch base. I genuinely want to have a conversation with you know on my channel where like persons will show that you their tips but their tips don't necessarily work for you but yeah that's for, besides that's for another video i think i want to do a separate video from that but yeah so now i'm going with this hollywood pink going down giving it a flush nice look um, um if you guys are not aware how to get the perfect ombre um just continue watching it's very very easy and it also takes practice very flush and very nice cuticle area looking fine you don't want to go too close to the cuticle area either so you want that to kind of flush set the nail at an angle downward angle so the product runs in the downward position but you also have to manipulate it as you go so as i put the product um at a stress point and just at the tip area and i am working the product down i usually work with a medium to dry bead so i am able to manipulate the product fairly easily without the product running off um so yes so i do this and then i'll go in with another bead put it at the end and work it down and also flush it in with the other the first bead and i'll do this for the pinky nail also so when i am comfortable with this i will then go ahead and you know apply the pink very when i'm doing the top part of the you know the ombre i tend to go a little bit drier wetter because the product this product here or let me speak on this product here especially hollywood pink it dries fairly quickly and i don't know why so i tend to you know work a little bit more moist with this acrylic and that's about it i mean i'll be doing the, the motion is very repetitive ombre then um the normal way of ombre so it's very repetitive so i'll you know see you guys in the next clip
Okay, so the nails are looking bummer.com. So after the file and the shaping and all the wonderful stuff, I'm now going to be taking my poly gel brush to achieve the clouds. I mean, this took a lot of, you know, in and out. I mean, I, I was not getting the hang of doing it. I look at multiple tutorials on how to draw. And I was like, all right, I'm going to stop this. I'm just going to, you know, figure out how to do this. So now I'm going in with my poly gel brush to kind of create the outline of what I, I want. And then I'll go in with a more detailed brush to go over the clothes so it looks more like a cloud. Um, I don't know what type of cloth is. I think this is a Stratos. It's, it's a Stratos. <laughs> <laughs> it's very hilarious it's let me know in the comments if you think it's a stratus or if it's the columbus or there's another one i can't quite remember what it is um yeah i mean i had a whole lot of fun creating these nails these these nails were on my you know mind for some time now i didn't know what color i wanted but i you know i enjoyed every bit of it it also kind of looked like a waves to me to be you know so yeah i really do enjoy it if you guys do enjoy this video go ahead and give me a like also subscribe to my channel um tap the bell so you get notified each and every time i upload because i upload twice a week every week and i post videos bonus videos here and there and also remember to follow me on my instagram at bear beauty services as i said i do um polls over there and you, you I, I know you definitely want to be a part of that so go and follow me over there and yes guys i hope you enjoy it and thank you guys so much for the you know the subscribers new subscribers here i hope you do enjoy this content over here and guys i'll see you in the next video